Friends, in this video, we are solving a problem on multiple integrals. Given problem is, evaluate integral from minus a to a and minus uh, square root of a square minus x square to plus square root of a square minus x square dy dx by changing into polar coordinates. You see friends, the given problem is, integral from minus a to a and integral from minus square root of a square minus x square to plus square root of a square minus x square dy dx. This is in Cartesian coordinates. Now, we have to evaluate this integration by changing into polar coordinates. How you can change into polar coordinates means, friends you see, if the function is in Cartesian coordinates to changing into polar coordinates, we are substituting x is equal to r cos theta comma y is equal to r sin theta and we have to change the limits of r uh, x comma y to r comma theta also and dx dy is there here dx dy is nothing but jacobian of dr d theta right what is the jacobian jacobian is nothing but the transformation between x comma y variable to r comma theta variable so here you will have r only after simplifying you will get r this one we have discussed in previous videos anyway jacobian is here r into dr into d theta so what about the region here we required the limits of here x comma y limits they are given now we have to convert into r comma theta limits what are the limits of r comma theta are they given directly no so how you can find out based on the integration limits so here the you observe this is a limit you observe minus square root of a square minus x square so it is a function of x whenever the limit is a function of x then you can whenever a limit is a uh, whenever a limit is a function of x then you can say it is a limit for y so y is uh, from minus a square to a square minus square root of a square minus x square to plus square root of a square minus x square from this you can say y square is equal to a square minus x square. So, x square plus y square is equal to a square. x square plus y square is equal to what? a square. So, this is a circle. The region is here, you see. Region is a circle with radius a. Region, rough sketch I am giving. So, this is x square plus y square is equal to a square. The region is a circle, full circle. And because minus a to a, they are mentioned. x is from minus a to a means this one. y is from negative to positive is nothing but the total circle we have to take. Next, what about the y value they are given? Here, this is y value. Next, x value. x is from minus a to plus a. So, directly here you have minus a to plus a. So, this is our region. In this region, we want r comma theta limits. Friends, you see, whenever the double integral uh, we are doing in a Cartesian coordinates and converting into uh, polar coordinates, the limits of r will become in terms of r comma theta by substituting x is equal to r cos theta comma y is equal to r sin theta and uh, dx dy is r into dr into d theta where r dash is a region the limits of r comma theta we are doing now this is a circle which circle x square plus y square is equal to a square this is in the form of x square plus y square equal to r square if you are substituted x is equal to r cos theta y is equal to r sin theta then x square plus y square is r square cos square theta plus r square sin square theta if r square is a comma then you will have cos square theta plus sin square theta is 1 therefore x square plus y square is equal to r square so r square is equal to a square so what you can say r is the radius with a so if you want to get the limits of r then draw the pole pole is nothing but like which is a straight line y is equal to x line where it is touches the given region here at the origin case here so in this case r value is 0 to a so zero, radius is a so r is lies between 0 to a means 0 less than r is equal to r less than r is equal to a and you observe this is the region is occupied in the four quadrants full circle this is so you have to take only first two quadrant means 0 to pi by 2 we are taking but in the two quadrants means first two quadrants then 0 to pi but it is in four quadrants so you have to take 0 to 2 pi only friends you may get a doubt sir uh, here in place of r square i have a square so can i take uh, r is equal to plus r minus a means generally radius is we are not taking negative sign x is minus a to a because x left side a distance and right side a distance but the radius is nothing but the formula of the radius uh, definition of radius is nothing but it is a uh, 
0 to a only. From the definition, you can say 0 to a only, not like minus a to a here. Okay. Now, this is a region. Now, given problem is limits from minus a to a minus square root of a square minus x square to plus square root of a square minus x square dx dy. Now, we are changing into polar coordinates. So, what we have the limits for r? r is from 0 to a and theta is from 0 to 2 pi. Yes. Now, dx dy. dx dy is what you have? r into dr into d theta. So, here the integrand you have r and the limits of r and theta both are independent. So, you can do irrespective of order. Nothing but you can do both at a time or else one after one you can do. I am doing a directly. Now, r integration is r square by 2 limits from 0 to a. Next, you have r quotient is 1. So, one integration with respect to theta is theta and the limits from 0 to 2 pi. So, 1 by 2 is outside. If I substituted upper limit, then I will have a square minus 0 square lower limit into 2 pi minus 0. So, this is a square by 2 into 2 pi. So, denominator 2 and numerator 2 getting cancelled. Then you will have a square pi. So, the solution is a square pi. Is it clear for everyone? Friends, if you have uh, any doubts hmm, or else uh, if you want more number of the problems, you can share freely. I will solve uh, for you. Thank you for watching this video.